Up next, the Gain Irish St. Ledger here at the Curra. A one mile six furlong event, Group 1. Small field of eight, selective. Go to post on this one. Number one, Rising Eagle for David Robertson. Two, Pine Barons for Molly Surfer. Three, Obi-Wan for Del Hinton. Four, Mickey Blue Eyes for Paul Rhodes. Five, Avalanche for Django. Six, The Sad Clown for Joshua Sutherland. Seven, Lee Meg for Del Hinton. And eight is Katra Sank for Paul Rhodes. Paul and Del got a couple in here, which puts us down just to six trainers. Challenging. The last one's coming forward. In the gates, flags are raised, and they're racing. The one that just missed the break there a little bit was Avalanche. It's a mile and six, so plenty of time to settle down. The one that came well out of the stalls is the Sad Clown that leads us. One of the jockeys uh, taking a paw as Obi Wan pulls alongside the Lee Meg, but it's still the Sad Clown. Finally settles. We go through the first couple of furlongs, and it's the Sad Clown still taking a paw. We want to lead here. Usual for Josh Sutherland horse to lead any event. It's the Sad Clown that's got a couple of lengths on the rest who are pretty close together. Lee Meg Rising Eagle and Obi Wan are all together. And the length back just a Mickey Blue Eyes, Catra Sank, Avalanche, and Pine Barons. So they're through the first half mile. And it's still the Sad Clown that leads us. A couple of lengths to the Rising Eagle. Just against the fence outside of him is Obi Wan, Mickey Blue Eyes. But a lot of the jockeys uh, still taking hold here. Fairly tactical, the Sad Clown the jockey looks round. It's where everyone else is, but it's the Sad Clown from Rising Eagle. We've got Pine Barrows and Mickey Blue Eyes. Catra Sank and Wide the Yellow Silks of Avalanche. Two Hollywood horses, Obi Wan and Lee Meg, are just bringing up the rear. With a mile still to travel, it's the Sad Clown that leads us. From Rising Eagle, Pine Barrows, Catra Sank and Mickey Blue Eyes. Avalanche Wide, Obi Wan and Lee Meg. to the Sad Clown's lead. They're happy to let him be three lengths ahead here. We're finally going to get down to the six furlong pole. It's the Sad Clown. Catra Sank just being pushed along a little bit here. Wants to get closer. Comes over towards the rail. Cuts in front of Rising Eagle. But it's the Sad Clown that leads by a couple to Catra Sank in second now. Mickey Blue Eyes being pushed through against the fence is still Rising Eagle. Everyone being pushed along now to try and... Uh, Cut into the lead of the Sad Clown is still there and we're inside five and he leads by a couple still. Catra Sank, the mech pushed out of the grip pack now. Rising Eagle still there. This is Pine Baron, so Obi Wan against the fence. We're inside four now, we're just less than half a mile to travel and it's a Sad Clown. Not been asked for anything yet. Jockey gets the whip out, gives him a couple of reminders and starts to head for home as we get down to the three furlong pole. Out of the pack comes Mickey Blue Eyes. So it's the Sad Clown being chased down by Mickey Blue Eyes, Lee Meg and Rising Eagle. Catra Sank, Pine Barrows and Obi-Wan and Avalanche got a lot to do from here as we come down to two furlongs from home. It's the Sad Clown now by a couple still from Mickey Blue Eyes, Lee Meg, Rising Eagle. Are they going to catch this lead? But it's the Sad Clown. Mickey Blue Eyes looks the greatest threat as they come down to a furlong from home. It's the Sad Clown from Mickey Blue Eyes. The Sad Clown's been there from the beginning. Is he going to Hold on, we come down to the final half and it's the Sad Clown from Mickey Blue Eyes trying to catch him, but it's not going to happen. The Sad Clown from Pillar to Post, Joshua Sutherland takes a gain Irish St. Ledger with the Sad Clown. Mickey Blue Eyes got up for second. Not sure who came third. It was Rising Eagle for David Robertson, Pine Barron, so Molly at Surfer was fourth and Catra Sank for Paul Rhodes fifth.